Now, previously, we saw Ralphie, Nate, and Zoe taking the Mega Transporters over to Blaze and Roxy, where they actually stole them from episode 18, which they're actually planning on teleporting a Morphex Tower. So, they have to get them back. However, we actually saw that Devin was at his father's re-election campaign, which Ben and Betty are actually riding around their <clears throat> unicycle, well, their bicycles, and they actually find the three mega transporters in a van where they actually been <clears throat> am ambushed by the Tronics. So, they actually are actually running scared, but Mayor Daniel say that he and his son will stay put until the Rangers are actually come. But we actually saw which the other Rangers have more, including Devin, have actually rescued Betty and Ben, and they actually followed the Tronics, which they have actually have found the three mega transporters. Which Squazzle is actually is angry that they actually let them take the Mega Transporters. So they decided to let a Giga Droid to do the distraction. While they actually do that, Ralphie decided to take the Mega, I mean, the mega Transporters over to Grid Battle Force. But the commander, his mother, actually told him not let his emotions get the best of him which he has to take the transporters over but he saw Roxy and he actually had no other choice so he actually decided to fight Roxy and he actually have battle and defeated his I mean her avatar at the same time that the ranger has defeated the giga droid which we actually saw that Roxy hasn't rank up, which his mother is disappointed that he disobeyed an order. But I mean, Ralphie has apologized, and he say is all on him, which she apologized as well. Which we saw Betty and Ben have found the first me mega transporters. And we actually knew they actually are about to transport a Morphex Tower. So they decided to take the transporters over to Great Battle Force. However, Mir Daniels actually came to Devin and he was actually disappointed the way that he's actually behaving. By which he actually saw that the Tronics, including Blaze, our peers, which he, we actually saw that Mayor Daniels protecting Betty and Ben while they're taking the Mega Transporter over to the headquarters, which the Rangers have morphed and actually battled Blaze, which he actually activated the two Mega Transporters and actually took it from Betty and Ben while they're actually in the Van and which a lesson learned if you want to take something make sure you close the trunk door before someone actually takes it and then we saw Devin fighting Blaze and which Blaze had defeated Devin which he demorphed in front of his father which he now learns that Devin is the Red Ranger which we saw that the Morphax Tower was transported as we saw Mayor Daniels try to run for his son, but it's actually too late as the trans as the tower, including Devin, has been transported into the cyber dimension, in which they are trying to build a way to get over to the cyber dimension, which in around the same time, Roxy has waken up with feeling that she actually has seen what the Avatar or Roxy have seen in which she shows of Squasso learning how to build a new body for Evox which the Morvax Tower is the perfect source 
for the Morph X, with a lot of that, he actually can build a new body for Evox. While Devin has been shackled, we actually see the Morph X and the machine creating a new body for Evox. Now, we saw that I mean, Ralphie defeated Evox. I mean, sorry, sorry, Roxy. Sorry, little mind bender, what I just saw. However, we actually seen the final battle of season one of Power Rangers Beast Force. We actually get to see what's going to happen on the next episode next weekend. So, anyway, like this video, subscribe for more, and comment on what you think about the episode. You guys can also follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Tumblr, and like my Facebook page. Until then, this is Anime Guys right here saying sign out. Laters!